never lose your love. That's the thing about it. <laughs> you just like me. You never lose your love. You know, be family. <laughs> but you don't take no shit off of me. You're now watching <laughs> Jewel TV. What is up, YouTube? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. It is your girl, Daisha. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button, hit that post notification bell so you can get a notification every time I upload a new video. Period. Ciao! Before we even get into this video, small disclaimer because I know that you guys are waiting on what I had to say in my last video, but today is a whole important, like, what I had to say can wait. Once you find out what it is, then you're, you're gonna see why. Today ain't even worth, worth you know, Instead, I am with I am with Tristan and we are at the park. I'm gonna show you guys whenever I get to a better view, but we're at the lake. This is me and Tristan's like one of our favorite spots. And I can tell that he actually enjoys it because when we go places and Tristan doesn't like to go, he's not walking. He is not walking. <laughs> but when we come here, he enjoys it. He looks around. He walks, he runs, he races me. I've always had kind of just zen when I'm around water. And so I figured that today would be the perfect day to come around some water. Because if you guys don't know, April 9th um, of last year, 2022, marks the year and day that my dad passed away. And so today marks one year. It is also Easter Sunday and I tried to stay out of my feelings. In a way I did, um, but they kind of took over just a little bit. So came by some water and I knew that my son would still have a good time in the process. So it's actually beautiful y'all look. When I get to a better area, y'all be able to see once I get over there area it's easier so, I did Tristan's hair yesterday I don't know if you can tell it was done yesterday but it looks a lot better than what I was thinking Tristan doesn't like to wrap his hair up so I'm gonna catch all when we get farther and by the water doggy Doggy. Oh, <laughs> you see the doggy Oh. <laughs> Doggy. Dog dog. Dog dog dog. Let's see the ducks. Let's see the ducks. See the duckies. absolutely love this park y'all like just love it and I don't ever feel unsafe coming out here either it's, it's definitely a a relaxing environment there's plenty of like residences around here too so it's pretty tight knit it's getting kind of cold out here should have been a little smart about it because we're by the lake, but I bought us some extra jackets. I just left them in the car. I have a really bad habit of preparing myself and not following through with preparing myself. Like I'll get stuff together and I will either leave it in the car or I'll leave it at home. I love my life. I love it. I'll race you. I'll race you. I'll race you. Water literally always helps like once I get halfway through this walk usually like my emotions are kind of clear every time hey it's about this time of morning you just born so I guess you still sleep but I just call the day after breakfast and I'll call you back later on.
How my grandbaby mother doing? Daddy, love you, sweetheart. He just came and walked straight across us. this I think that we are gonna go to my parents house I'm gonna go to my mom and my stepdad's house and let them see Tristan for Easter um, I'm gonna let him open his Easter basket because I got him an Easter basket so I'm gonna let him open his Easter basket he was with me when I got it but I don't think he understands yet what it is exactly or that it was even for him but once he gets into it, he'll be excited. I got him a dinosaur themed one. So I'm gonna show you guys when we get back in the car because it's super cute. She also made Easter food yesterday. So we ate there yesterday and I was supposed to be cooking today, but I low key think I'm about to go and, and slip some food from her house again. My purse will not stay on my shoulder. Hold on y'all. It's so nice out right here. Where we were just now when the sun wasn't shining on us, when I say it was cold, interesting, just taking his sweet little time. Come on, son, it's cold out here. I'm getting more and more used to filming in public and that much I can appreciate. Though I can say I never really was the nervous type to be filming in public. I just sometimes don't feel like answering questions. But now just know if you have a fear of filming in public, use that as a promotion opportunity. Tell somebody you're filming for your YouTube channel and tell them your YouTube channel link. Put them in the video so they want to go back and see it. <laughs> little, little tip. Let me show y'all something. So I'm going to show y'all this view. So bright. Oh my God. handsome man's hey, handsome. oh wow you're talking to him okay wait hold on <laughs> okay you can talk to them here what you got to say what you got to say what you got to say child my camera was about to be on the ground or in the water so i think that this walk did help me clear my head just a little bit um in regards to my dad I know that the pain kind of never really goes away, but it does get easier to manage, I guess. Um, I do wish that he had an opportunity to meet my son. But um, I'm thinking that my dad, he kind of just held some things back from me for my protection, which I've learned I don't like secrets. <laughs> I don't like secrets. Um, but when my dad was getting sick, he did make sure to tell me a lot of important things. Just in his way of telling me, I didn't realize that I should have been instilling it right there. No one ever wants to think that their parents are leaving or that anything's gonna happen to their parents. And my mother is still here, so I've never been through anything like that. Um, I do have siblings from my dad. I have two brothers, um, my dad, had two other marriages prior to me. I was the baby, I was the late one. Um, I was a twin, but um, basically my brothers lived different parts of my dad's life. So my very first brother, he lived my dad's younger part of his life. Um, my middle brother, his middle part of his life and me, kind of the late and last stages or last 20 years, <laughs> um, 24 years, 23 years, but um, 22 and a half, let's say that. And then some, cause you know, he was with my mom for a couple of years or years before they even had me. But regardless, it, it's great and it's a blessing to be able to be learning different parts of my dad's life thanks to my brother um, and my brothers and their mom. Um, Sadly, my other brother's mom passed away a couple months after my dad. 
So, <sighs> so I'm gonna go ahead and end this video off. Well, I'm not even gonna end this video, but I'm gonna go ahead and say that I'm about to pause this video right here. This lady just stopped in. She's just looking at me. <laughs> but nice car behind me, period. Per, per, per. I'm about to cut this video off right here. I'm gonna catch you guys when I go to my mom's house and we can have like a real, real talk or whatever. So yeah, I hope that you guys liked what I was able to show you guys. Um, and thank you for tuning in. I'm gonna see you guys in the next video. Or see you guys in the next clip. I'm sitting here acting like I'm about to go. But in case this is the end of the video, thank you so much for watching this video. Hit that subscribe button, hit that post notification bell so you can get a notification every time I upload a new video. Trista try to cut the camera off. Hold on, hold on. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> I'll see y'all in the next clip. <laughs>